Welcome to Death Over Dinner. You might be asking yourself, what could death and dinner possibly have in common? Or maybe you're wondering why someone would even want to talk about death, especially over an otherwise pleasant supper. Well, here's the deal. The way we die in America, and now in many other parts of the world, is pretty messed up. Not just the fact that we die. End-of-life care is far from ideal, and it causes a lot of bankruptcies. Most people die in hospitals, and they are really expensive. Yet, 75% of America says they want to die at home, and only 25% of us do. Regardless of where we spend our last weeks, days, or moments, the thing we are really missing is a straightforward conversation. It's obvious if you think about it. If you don't tell your loved ones what you want during your last mile, you won't get it. Say, for example, you wanted a vacation in Aruba, but you didn't tell anyone, and your well-meaning family booked you a long, costly ticket to Antarctica. Not what you wanted. The default when it comes to dying is also very expensive. And like Antarctica, most likely not what you wanted. Not telling your loved ones what you want only makes everything a lot harder for everyone, emotionally and logistically. They're already going to be devastated by losing you. On top of that, imagine having to make a seemingly endless list of decisions and to make them immediately during your grief. So we came up with a simple solution. Dinner and conversation. Just talking to each other, openly, directly, authentically. Since we launched, there have been over 100,000 dinners in 30 countries. It seems these two things go together quite nicely. So, what happens at a death dinner? It all begins with our website. You tell us why you're interested in having a dinner, and when you select an intention, we magically create a script for your evening. In this script, you will find a series of thoughtful questions for everyone who comes to dinner to consider an answer. If you don't like a particular question, don't answer it. And that's about it. But here are a few pointers. Don't surprise people. Pizza night. Surprise. Death dinner. No. Don't hog the talking stick. Put that phone away. No one needs you to be checking your Instagram while they are talking about how they want to be remembered. Make something simple. Light some candles. Create the right ambiance. Give yourself plenty of time. Make I statements. This is not an opportunity to argue. There are no experts in death. Listen deeply. Say something you're afraid to say. It is the quickest way to get closer to the people in your life. When you're done, maybe you want to take some next steps and put a few things in writing. Our goal is to change the way we die one conversation at a time. Join us.